Hearing this, the bride apparently fainted. The groom was extra cautious in adjusting his headgear. What is actually going on here? Up bride, what the hell is an up bride? Well, UP is Uttar Pradesh, which is a place in India where they have these very elaborate wedding ceremonies. This bride-to-be, she noticed that the groom was being extra cautious and repeatedly adjusting his traditional headgear. And he was being really, really careful with it, really sort of preoccupied. She's getting suspicious and apparently one of her friends told the bride that the groom was actually bald and that he was wearing a wig on his head. Hearing this, the bride apparently fainted and fell on the stage. Later when she regained consciousness, no matter how much persuasion the family and friends tried to uh, convince her, it's fine, it's fine. Apparently she refused to marry him. It's covered by loads of different news outlets. They're calling it the real life Bala. This movie, 2019 movie, talking about this guy who hides his balding, what they call premature balding, but let's be honest, what does that term even mean? From his wife-to-be in order to get her to marry him, right? There's so many men who this is like deep-rooted fear, and it's gonna kind of make them click and read this sort of thing, right? So I don't say that this could, isn't true. You know, this is very well could be true, and this woman, hey, you know, she could think, you know, he's wearing a wig, that's not for me, and that's what comes across in this story. You know, if you just read it like that at face value, it's like, oh my God, she, the woman will never marry a man who's wearing a wig or who's bald or whatnot, but, I suspect, guys, if we think about this logically, I think that the real issue here is it's not the being bold, it's not the losing the hair, it's not wearing the wig even, it's the hiding aspect. It reminds me of those viral videos where guys like, she'll never recognize him on his wedding day, right? Where they put all the fibers in there and they do absolute magician's work, okay? This guy obviously wasn't fully comfortable on his wedding day because he was nervous, right? He was had this secret and he didn't want people to know. Now, one thing I couldn't get from the research I did is, do they spend much time with each other before they get married? He must have been an absolute expert at keeping this hidden until the wedding day, I guess. Maybe the pressure, all of that stuff was just too much. Maybe he wanted this secret outed a little bit and he was just, you know what I mean? Subconsciously, it was all over the place and there it was. Uh, his secret was revealed and it's kind of ended some might say ended negatively. Others like myself probably feel like, you know what dude, lucky escape there because for you to keep up that for the rest of your life, trying to keep this secret hidden, it's not gonna do you well. Groom returns home without getting married. A bride refused to marry the groom on the wedding day after she saw him wearing a wig. So you read that, you might just think, <sighs> This hair loss stuff is game over, you know, even wearing a wig, I'm still gonna end up forever alone. Whatever you decide to do with your hair, I am neither here nor there. Live that truth, do not hide. Bloody wear the hell out of it, but do not live this life where you have this thing and you're trying to play it off like this hair loss stuff has never happened. You're never gonna be fully comfortable knowing that it's just not the truth inside you. You're never gonna be fully comfortable like that. I'm ranting now guys, but I just wanted to comment on this one, you know. Just to show that again, the way this is kind of reads, it's like, yeah, very well could be the fact that she's like, oh no, I can't be with like a, a bold guy. Absolutely fine. The bigger problem here is like I said, he's hiding something from his wife to be. The person that you're supposed to have this absolute trust in, he's only doing what he probably feels like he needs to do. And it's because of, you know, things like this, where it's like everything comes across like this is some horrible thing that like you need to hide from the world. We end up in situations like this. So guys, whatever you decide to do, Live the absolute truth. You've got nothing to hide, nothing to fear, nothing to be ashamed of. India, again, really coming out with the hair loss content, you know. Let me know your opinion on this. Thanks for watching. I, of course, will see you in that next video. Goodbye. Big shout out to Rob for sharing this story with me.